All right, everyone, this is Vitamin G, back again for after my uh, super ridiculously long hiatus. <clears throat> but I recently moved into a new apartment and didn't really have time to set up everything. And then a lot of shit happened, so long story short, I'm back. And for this video, I'm gonna be showing you, if you can't tell by the title, how to get the survival achievement, Mr. Sparkle, in the Simpsons arcade game. So I'm just gonna set up a game right now using the Japan ROM survival on easy. And you always wanna make sure you start on the first level, otherwise it does not count. So I'm gonna pick Homer, cause Homer. he's my favorite character. I like using specials and he has a pretty good one where it has a decent range. Um, you can spam it and not worry about shit happening. Or is like, I mean, Lisa's pretty much the same. She has a good range. Bart, his is kind of weird, and the hitbox isn't the greatest. And Marge just sucks. I don't know anyone that likes playing as Marge. I mean, she uses a vacuum cleaner. She's unrealistic with blue hair, and why can't I skip that? There we go. All right. So the first level is very straightforward, like... I'm not even going to grab a health because I'm not going to, I'm not even going to come close to dying. Uh, when you get to this place, you want to pick up the bomb, and as soon as the kid shows up, throw it, or throw the nuke, and normally that would kill everyone in like, immediately, but somehow it did happen that time, so, um, but yeah, I'm going to be using specials mostly the entire run through, um, so yeah. Except right there, where my controller did not count that as a special when I did hit both buttons. I, I swear to god I did. And yeah, I'm just brushing through this like... Like a fat guy on a hot dog. Oh! And I'm just gonna go above and below him, special. Above. As soon as you see him get up on his knees, do your special and you will not even get hit. And right there, I went through the entire level, didn't get hit once, because it's partly memory, because I knew everything about the level, and I, I don't know, I didn't rush forward and get, I do not have a turbo controller. Immediately use the special on this crusty on the ball, and you should be uh, not have to worry about him. Always use your special on the ball crusties because that's an insta kill. Uh, now a little secret: there is an apple right here. Just use the special and grab that. I'm going to be grabbing health in this level uh, just because. Sometimes I get effed over, sometimes I don't. Um, but items are your friend in this level. There's quite a bit of them. Grab the donuts. Your best friend, which I'll be using throughout the rest of the level, is the mallet. Why? Because in the Japan ROM, the mallet does not uh, go away after so many uses. Um, and secondly, it kills the boss in 11 hits, which I prefer. And immediately when you kill that last cup guy, um, these, one of these dudes shows up in, like right away, so be careful for that. And watch out for the cart. Just walk forward and jump, and you should be safe. These hat guys are my least favorite enemy in the game. And to get those guys to throw the item without getting hit, normally I just walk down and jump, so I'm still in their range of getting hit but I don't get it. Alright. 
and I think this is so far... Oh, roommate's home. So far I think this is a non-hit level run thing as well. Hey Alex! Hi. I'm recording, so yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, probably thank you card from my cousin's wedding. If not, why didn't you guys thank me? Yeah, I went crazy with the setup. <laughs> I won't be doing it long, don't worry. And there's my head. Yeah, I'm just recording some YouTube videos. Lord of Cleavage. Yeah, it smells like cat piss. Or actually, it really smells like SpaghettiOs for some reason. <laughs> All right, so this level you just inch forward. That's what she said, and try to keep as little enemies on screen as possible. Um, six and a half minutes. Oh, so you just started. Yeah. Like, it took about a half hour to set all this up. Yeah, for those wondering, I have a 42-inch TV, which my computer is hooked up to, so I can see what I'm playing, or what I'm recording. And then next to that is a 52-inch for my Xbox, is hooked up to live. And if you're wondering what capture device is, I already made a video, so um, I don't feel like doing another one this year, but maybe in the future. But yeah, inch forward. I always grab the slingshot, and as soon as you see the cross, one guy's going to show up behind me, or the bomb. Uh, then go up here, move forward a little bit. And there's one, and then there will be one more down there. And I'm going to throw the slingshot. Normally I don't, but you want to walk. As soon as the zombies show up, throw a bomb. And they're all dead. And I really do not like these guys at all. But I try to stay below them and use a special to kill them, but they will hit you off. I'm doing horrible. Oh god. Just move forward and grab that. And... Okay, there's a bomb. See, so I used the bomb to my advantage and killed three of them in one, one throw. And this guy's gonna suck. Oh, no. I thought maybe he just won away, but yeah. Funny story, this part, as a child playing it in the arcades, I had to close my eyes because it was too scary. <clears throat> yeah, so... Finally, when I was 29, I got over that fear. But I remember playing it when I was 17, and I was still terrified by that. I had nightmares for weeks. That's not really the truth. I. I think I, last time I saw it in the arcade, I was 13. But yeah, the elevator, you just want to, as soon as someone gets on the ground, run up to that spot and use a special. If you're good, you can try to hit them before if they're standing on a platform and they'll fall to their death. But I don't really rely on that because I need to move around fast and attack people. Now, I just made it to the, final, the third level boss, and this will get you the achievement. Now I'm not going to do this, uh, the achievement won't pop because I already have it, but I'm not going to do this just because I did this on a friend's account and got to the second form of Mr. Burns. I just kept going, and he's now ranked ninth in the world for survival, which is hilarious because, I don't know, I don't like leaderboard people that search it for people asking for help, so the fact that I'm not on there makes me happy. 
but when the game first came out, I was number one on the leaderboards, and I got several messages. Did not like it. So whoever hacked the leaderboard, thank you. But on that note, I'm going to end the video, and uh, people on TA, if you're watching this and this has helped you, leave a thumbs up, leave a comment. If you're on YouTube and this helped you, leave a thumbs up, leave a comment. Um, if you're on YouTube and you don't know what TA is, it's TrueAchievements.com. It's a really good site where you can uh, meet up with other people that need the same achievements as you, um, hear the latest news about Xbox Live stuff and how much PS3 sucks. And, uh, <laughs> I said that because my roommate just walked in. Um, but yeah, anyways, talk to you soon.